see Princess Mary of Denmark's unusual sign of respect for Queen Marguerite. During a gala concert at Fredensborg Palace on Wednesday, Mary was seen pressing herself against a wall. Crown Princess Mary has the utmost respect for her mother-in-law, Queen Marguerite, even if the gesture raises some eyebrows. During a gala concert at Fredensborg Palace on Wednesday, Mary was seen pressing her back against a wall as the Queen entered the royal box in an apparent sign of respect. Queen Marguerite then took the middle seat of the front row, with Mary and Crown Prince Frederick sitting on either side of her to enjoy the musical performances. The music program offered a mix of Greenlandic, Faroe and Danish music culture, and along the way there was a common song Now Thank All God where the verses were sung alternating the three languages, according to the Danish royal's Instagram page. The outing comes weeks after Princess Mary was named a regent, meaning she can perform duties as head of state when the queen is unavailable. For the event, Princess Mary wore an elegant red dress featuring a keyhole neckline and long sleeves paired with silver heels, while Queen Marguerite opted for a forest green ensemble. Crown Princess Mary of Denmark looked incredibly chic as she stopped by the Boss Ladies Project on Wednesday. The Australian-born royal, 50, oozed elegance in a relaxed navy suit as she posed for photographs in Copenhagen. The Boss Ladies Project aims to motivate more young women to enter and develop their talent within the building and construction industry. She paired the suit with Vega V12 leather sneakers, Julon Delphis gold earrings and a gold Vega bracelet. Mary styled her hair in a bouncy blow-dry and wore natural-looking foundation and black mascara. At one point, Mary was seen greeting fellow attendees before playfully placing a construction hat on her head as they posed for photos together. Mary, born Mary Elizabeth Donaldson, is one of the most respected women on the international scene. She famously met her husband Crown Prince Frederick of Denmark by chance at Sydney Pub The Slip in during the 2000 Olympics. After their encounter, Fred, who was in Australia to support Denmark's Olympic sailing team, asked Mary for her phone number and a romance blossomed. The first time we met we shook hands. I didn't know he was the Prince of Denmark. Half an hour later someone came up to me and said, Do you know who these people are? Mary revealed in an interview about meeting the heir to the Danish throne. They maintained a long-distance relationship for a year with Frederick making secret trips down under before Mary moved to Denmark to study Danish language at Copenhagen's study school in 2001. In early 2003, Frederick's mother Queen Marguerite publicly acknowledged the relationship and the couple announced their engagement at Omalenborg Castle later that year on October 8. Frederick and Mary married on May 14, 2004 at Copenhagen Cathedral with the newly minted crown princess opting for a beautiful gown by Danish designer Ruffer Frank and a veil first used by crown princess Margaret of Sweden in 1905. Their first child, Prince Christian Valdemar Henri John, was born October 15, 2005, Princess Isabella Henrietta Ingrid Marguerite followed on April 21, 2007. Almost four years later Mary and Frederick welcomed twins. Princess Josephine Sophia Ivalo Matilda and Prince Vincent Frederick Minnick Alexander at the Riggs Hospital in Copenhagen on January 8, 2011. <laughs>
October 15, 2005, Princess Isabella Henrietta Ingrid Marguerite followed on April 21, 2007. Almost four years later Mary and Frederick welcomed twins, Princess Josephine Sophia Ivalo Matilda and Prince Vincent Frederick Minnick Alexander at the Rigsch Hospital in Copenhagen on January 8, 2011.